my dear so in this video we're going to discuss about how to find out entropies at various points of this vcrs cycle so let me draw very quickly please all this so we are going to calculate entropies at various points i hope you know the definition of entropy because i have already shared with you guys so a b c d e now what we are, we are going to do here we are going to find out we are going to write formula i must say not find out uh, how how much value or what would be the formula for finding out entropy for these all points okay so let me share with you few points s b and s t at this point we have saturated vapor that's why this will be directly s g at this point we have saturated liquid that's why it would be directly s f now if i'll try to calculate entropy under this section then we i i have to consider x that means dryness fraction and you know the value of dryness fraction is uh, uh, cannot be greater than one okay so if i wanted to find out entropy at this point so hc is equal to here if i wanted to calculate h i mean sc then i have to consider one thing sc will be greater than sb so that's why sf plus x sf plus x s f g i can write this equation like this s f plus x into s g minus s f again the same condition entropy at vapor condition of the same matter is always greater than entropy at liquid condition of the same matter okay now let's move to the next next one i mean let's find out h s e s e is equal to how much s g plus cp natural log te minus t i mean te by td and if i wanted to find out entropy at this point h i mean s a therefore s f minus cp here cp would be vapor here cp would be for liquid and natural log tb our uh, tb by ta so this is how you, you, i mean how you can find out entropies of various points on bcrs cycle so this is all about bcrs cycle extension of bcrs cycle well i have already shared with you enthalpies at various point and here you are learning about entropies at various point so basically what happened we need to know i mean to remember the formulas and one of the best way to remember formulas is to calculate no i mean to, to find out or solve numerical problems well i hope you understand the concept thanks for watching and hope to see you again in my next video bye bye